we knew Shriner had uh, put together a competitive match yesterday against Colorado College, and um, you know we knew they were going to come out and play pretty good doubles. They always do. Uh, their head coach is kind of like me and kind of built around the doubles. Um, got a good sense for the game. So we knew their guys would come out with some spunk there, and they didn't disappoint. They were all fired up and ready to go. Um, ultimately, we were able to kind of weather the initial kind of adrenaline rush um, and, and kind of create space for all the teams. Uh, we were able to sweep the doubles and get out to a 3-0 lead pretty comfortably, which was nice. Uh, that always helps with the momentum, especially when you're going into singles and you know you're playing to decision at that point. So first team to five, and they stop the match. So after the 3-0 lead, uh, we felt like we were in a good spot. Um, it was a really muggy day today, hot and just heavy conditions. Uh, so it was a, a real uh, priority to try to be as efficient as possible, get the guys off the court. Um, and Wilson helped us out immensely with that. He raced out and was able to get a, an 0-0 win uh, at line two to give us our fourth point. And then not too long after, um, Jordan Pitts, our first year uh, at line three, was able to clinch the, the duel for us with a 1-0 win and uh, get us to move on to the finals. So we'll go against uh, Southwestern, who we, um, you know, we just played a week ago. Uh, we know what they're going to bring. They're going to bring a lot of energy. They've got guys that believe in what they're doing, uh, and they're going to be a stiff competition. So we're excited for it, uh, but we're also ready for it. So we'll see them tomorrow in the finals.